You've probably seen this survival trick before, and depending on your item spawns, it totally could help you. But it can also burn your fingers or your house down if you don't do it properly, so don't try any of the following. And I know what you're thinking. Wouldn't making the gum wrapper skinnier increase the resistance to electrons flowing, meaning that it should draw less current and therefore consume less power, meaning it gets less hot, not more? But since making it skinny clearly makes it hotter in reality, could making it too skinny result in a disaster? Well, to answer the first part, yes, less total power would be consumed by the skinnier gum wrapper, but that doesn't lead to the correct conclusion. Unlike the first case where power is consumed roughly equally everywhere with the constant width, the power consumption is much more concentrated to the skinny section of the gum wrapper. That's observable with this thermal camera, but can be even more beautifully summarized using a few calculations, where there's two resistors. One for the skinny region in the center, shown in red, and one for the thick section, shown in blue. After taking measurements and using the formula to calculate resistance, you unsurprisingly see that the total resistance does increase in the second case. And yes, that means there's less current drawn from the battery and less total power is consumed. Nothing new there, but the real answer as to why it gets hotter is by looking at how much of that smaller total power is consumed just by the skinny section. If you divide by the surface area to see how concentrated that power consumption is, you can see that it's 25 times more concentrated in that small middle section for this example. I did this for a variety of different widths, and sure enough, the skinnier it is, the more concentrated it becomes. However, this is a simple model, and in reality, if you make it too skinny, you run into a different problem, which is that it burns and tears almost immediately, which leaves you with a boring old open circuit where no more current flows. There's one more factor that lets this work, which is that the resistance changes with temperature. So as the middle part gets hotter more quickly, the resistance also rises more quickly in the center, which further concentrates the power, resulting in a higher temperature, and this cycle continues until the paper coating is ignited. Thanks for watching to the end, let me know if you think I missed anything, and I'll see you next time.